We just got a brand new package from Scooter Village. Let's unwrap her and see what we got inside. And the bottom half of the scooter. So, this is the Core SL2 Complete Scooter. This comes five wide by 20 long, and it comes in, I believe, three different sizes, which is the Neo Chrome, the Chrome with some teal accents on it, and this black, which I have got here. And here we have the Core SL2 bars. Cool grips and a cool clamp on here. Can't forget the uh, owner's manual. Actually came with a spare axle. That's pretty cool. Have an Allen key to put your scoot together. I have my own here. These bars come 540 by 620 millimeters and these are super light aluminium. Uh, what else to do than to just chuck this scooter together? We've just left my house now on the way to the skate park and when we get there we're gonna give this a test ride and see how we like the scooter. For those wondering this is not gonna be my main scooter. I'm just testing this complete out for this video. In the next video I'll make a custom of it with the parts I want to put on it for my current scooter. We have arrived at the local. We've got the new scooter here. Now let's chuck you guys on my head and we'll get some clips with this awesome new Core SL2 Complete Scooter. I'm gonna give you guys my first impressions of this scooter and I just gotta say first things first these bars being 580 tall by 620 wide I don't really think that works I feel like bars always have to be taller than they are wider but Corb decided to make it that way so that's what it is I'll be chucking my own tie bars on it later anyway uh, the deck is like super light, so it feels great to be whipping around. The box ends actually don't feel too bad on it, um, if you guys haven't seen already. These come with nylon dropouts. I believe I didn't say this already, but the wheels are 110 millimeters diameter by 24 wide. These forks are IHC compression. One thing I've got to say is I love the design on these bars. I just realized with this scooter is she is quite flimsy, and that's not really a good sign. I've tried tightening it even more, but it just it. won't tighten, just keeps going around and around circles, which is a bit of a concern. I reckon let's try and get some air tricks on this scooter, then we'll end off this video. So let's do that. Alrighty, let's get five air tricks on the quarter on this small forefoot, then we'll get more air clips in the bowl. This thing whips so fast, even with these box ends in. For this last trick, let's try a stall trick on the quarter. Let's go whip front feeble, whip back feeble, and just jump in. So to end off this video, I'm gonna do five air tricks in the bowl. All right, I reckon we got a buttercup. For this next one, Let's go heel rewind, light whip. Oh, let's go, that's a new learn. All right, even though these bars are 620 mil wide, I wanna try bar whip air. Okay, so for number four, we're gonna do something a little bit more chill, more on the technical side. Let's get a Mac. For number five, let's go whip front. Yo! 
there you have it guys there has been just a few clips on this core sl2 complete scooter if you guys are looking to pick up one of these i got mine off of scooter village if you guys like this video make sure to like and subscribe if you're new let me know what you guys think of this scooter down in the comments below in the next video i'm going to be mashing this scooter with my other current scooter together to make one ultimate scooter <laughs> peace out